Welcome to Minnesota Music Mom. I'm Karen Davis. And welcome to another corner of my house. You've seen the upstairs where my piano is, and this is downstairs. Uh, we are always seem we always seem to be in a stage of remodeling. So we've got, you know, wires sticking out of the wall and, <laughs> and we've got a floor here that isn't finished. Um, but this is where where the organ sits for now. Now this organ is a con, and this is the first organ that I bought with my own money back in 1979. My mom had an organ but um, I was engaged and going to be moving out and so I was playing for church and I was going to need my own organ. So I um, bought this one and from the family that I bought it from, they had already had it for quite a number of years. So I really don't know how old this organ is, but um, I bought it in 1979 and it really, it, it needs a lot of work now. Um, there was a period of time where it was not being used and um, so now, the, even when all the stops are off, some of it still plays, and the volume goes on its own. It's like it's possessed. Um, some of those stops don't work, and when I try to do the, the volume pedal down there, um, it just there's no not a lot of control over it. So I don't really use it a lot, but I had a couple of viewers that knew that I have this organ, and um, they asked me to do a video. So I thought, well, I might as well do my, my birthday video <laughs> on the con, on the con organ. Uh, as you see, I have a birthday hat on. It was my birthday here uh, just several days ago. And my oldest son, Chad, did a surprise for me. He advertised Minnesota Music Mom YouTube channel on TikTok. And I did not see the advertisement, but in essence, it just said something like, um, that we would like to get, um, my mom would like to get her Minnesota Music Mom channel up to 250 subscribers by her birthday. And I think that was like three days before my birthday or something like that. Um, at the time I was at 225 subscribers. Well, I tell you what, the support was just amazing. It blew me out of the water, honestly. In the matter of two or three days, I got over 100 subscribers. Thank you so much. Right now, it is at 418. So within just a few days, it went from 225 to 418. I, I don't even know what to say. It, it, thank you so much. And the comments, oh, the comments have been wonderful. I've got birthday wishes and comments, positive comments about the channel. I just honestly, truly a heartfelt thank you to you all. Thank you so much. So then um, Chad, my oldest son said, well, hey mom, on your next video, which will be kind of like your birthday video, how about if you play your favorite song and then sing? <laughs> and I'm like, okay, okay. That's a nice idea, Chad, but there's two things I want you to know. The first one is I can pick a song, but I don't have like one favorite song. I have lots of favorite songs over the whole spectrum. I mean, you got country western and Christian music and rock and roll and you know hip hop. I mean, I just I just have favorite songs all over the place. So I'll try to pick one of those. But um, the other thing is I don't think I should sing. <laughs> I said you know all those subscribers <laughs> that we just got. If I sing, <laughs> they're all going to disappear like water going down the drain. So I don't think I should do that. So I did pick a favorite song. And um, first of all, I want to say that with this organ, after I get done playing the music, I would like to, um, I'm going to grab my phone and um, come on over here so that you can see the organ. Those of you that are interested in organ, the instrument, you know, organs, the instrument, um, I'll show you the stops close up. And... Uh, also, after the songs, I would like to tell you two more tips. Um, my last video, I had given tips on turning pages smoothly while you're playing. And in the meantime, um, or after I did that video, I got two more tips that I can share with you. So the song that I chose for my favorite song is called There's a Long, Long Trail. And this is uh, what it looks like. Now, my new phone here is making it a little more difficult for me to do these videos. <laughs> But this is out of the book, Family Songbook Reader's Digest. And this is my mom's book. She also has other uh, songbooks by Reader's Digest. And I did look online and this is available, um, you know, probably used. I didn't look in detail, but I did see some websites where this is available. I think probably um, other people, you know, that want to sell them. 
but it's a great book. It has really nice songs in it. And my mom and I used to sit um, on her organ bench side by side. I would play the pedal, she would play the manual, we would sing songs out of this book. And so this book has a lot of, a lot of memories for me. So there's a long, long trail also has memories for me as far as over my family's a variety of uh, gener a few generations. So I can talk a little bit about that too after the songs. But I thought well, as long as I'm playing this song out of here, I might as well play a few more songs out of here um, that mom and I used to sing together. So that's what this video will be is, uh, is some songs out of this Reader's Digest book. All right, the first one is called There's a Long, Long Trail. to put my birthday hat since you probably can't see it anyway <laughs> there's my new my new phone you can't see my my head and my feet at the same time uh, okay the next song is I'm forever blowing bubbles Was I'm forever blowing bubbles. And next is April showers. Hopefully I'm not shouting at you. My new phone also has to be so far away that uh, the volume, you know, I don't have a lot of recording equipment. <laughs> My phone is it. So the farther away it doesn't pick up the voice. So I hope I'm not shouting at you. But the next one is April showers.
little showers. All right, and then this is also one of my favorite ones is it's Till We Meet Again. by the light of the silvery moon you know I used to really uh, I mean my mom could play these with without a hitch she could sit down and play she could sit down and play anything I was so jealous it took me a long time to learn some of these <laughs> songs I still can't get them right and she could just you know I would flip through the page through the book and I'd say oh how about this one and maybe she wouldn't have even played it ever before and oh sure you know she'd start playing it I'm like okay <laughs> I don't have her talent, that's for sure. Okay, so this is By the Light of the Silvery Moon. I'm trying to remember how I had these set. Mm -hmm. You know, I will say some of the notes I'm playing that sound wrong are really written in here, so I just want to point that out, okay? All right, this one is There is a Tavern in the Town. Let's see, how, how, did, how did I do this? fun to play. All right, and then we have When Irish Eyes Are Smiling. Let's see here.
Irish eyes are smiling. And then two songs left. One is Whispering Hope. Oops, I'm sorry. Spring Hope. Okay, and the last song is the Battle Hymn of the Republic. Let's see if I can remember how I had this set. <laughs> to these songs. I know it's a little out of the ordinary of how I usually do it, but um, this is my birthday video so I can do what I want. <laughs> this is out of Family Songbook Reader's Digest. That's where all these um, songs were out of. All right, now a couple things. Um, I wanted to give you a couple more suggestions um, about how to turn the pages smoothly. One idea that I forgot to tell you about is uh, the light. It depends on what light you have. Like for instance here, um, it depends on the light and the instrument that you're playing on, whether it's a piano or organ and how much room you have here. Because now here, if I turn the page, it's, it's, it's hitting. Okay, so you have to be aware of that before you play the song, because if you practice at home and when you turn the page, it's not hitting the light, and then you get to wherever it is that you're going to be performing, you have to be uh, aware ahead of time if when you turn the page, it's going to hit the light, because that's just going to, you know, Flub up just a little bit, give you a little more um, seconds of, you know, trying to recover yourself. And so just be aware of what light you're going to be working with and if the page hits the light or not. The other thing is um, Liz on a Facebook um, 
page that I'm with um, for organists and musicians and so forth. She said, I love this. <laughs> I love this. She said she paid one of her kids 10 cents a page <laughs> to turn the page. I'm like, oh man, that's choice. That's great. No, I turned the page for my mom, but I, I didn't get paid. <laughs> of course, I was also playing pedal at the same time. I should have got more than 10 cents a page, but that would be another idea. Okay, so I wanted to tell you one other thing, and uh, and then I'm going to show you this close up. So the other thing I wanted to tell you is just that, um, you know, the, my favorite song, uh, There's a Long, Long Trail, that extends over uh, generations in my family, because when mom and I were playing out of this book, There's a Long, Long Trail, really, I just, uh, I loved it. I fell in love with it. And so what I did when we started to have children, we've got five kids, and when I would put them to bed, I would sing that song as one of the nighttime songs. Um, that was usually the one I would sing, and then I might sing some others as well. But I usually sang that song to them when I put them to bed. So then they would request it also. <laughs> they also fell in love with it. So then um, one time when one of my daughters, uh, Amber, when she went to my mom and dad's house and my mom was showing her on the organ, just some songs and so forth, Amber noticed uh, sheet music of it's, uh, there's a long, long trail and it's got a really pretty picture on it, um, you know, with, with the woods and a trail and people walking down and so forth. And that caught Amber's eye because um, she also draws pencil drawings and so forth. And so she asked my mom about it, and um, so mom started playing it for her. And Amber's like, oh, I know that song. <laughs> There's that song, okay, you know? And, and mom was like, well, how, how do you know this song? Because it's out of an old book, you know, and it's mom's book, and we don't have this book, didn't have this book at our house. And so then Amber said, well, mom sings that, you know, when we go to sleep, mom sings that um, from little, from when we were little on, she's been, you know, singing that to us um, at nighttime. And so then mom um, had mentioned it to me afterwards and she said she, she didn't realize, you know, that I was doing that. And she mentioned that it was also one of her favorite songs and she mentioned that it was her mom's, um, one of her mom's favorite songs and she could remember her mom playing it. So it's, it's come back from my, uh, stretches across from my grandma and, uh, and my mom and me, and then to my kids. So that's, that's a pretty special song for us. All right. Um, I wanted to show you this close up. So let me do that. Let me see if I can grab this and show you the organ close up. All right. I got to flip this around here too. Um, let me, let me try to do this. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Okay, there we go. I know my kids will probably say, well, why don't you just edit the video? I'm like, that's okay. I'll just, <laughs> I'll just do it. Okay, so here we go. This is for the swell. And that's for the great manual. And then the pedals, uh, not all the pedals work. And that's for the swell. And this is for the great, and none of those work anymore. <laughs> All right, so that gives you, yeah, and never, you know, never mind the dust here. No, don't just, you know, don't mind the dust. I, cleaning is not my forte, okay? <laughs> All right, so that is the con organ that I bought in 1979 uh, before I was married. So I have had it a very long time. And there's the, the pedal board down there. All right, so let me turn this around here again and get me on. <laughs> Where's the camera here? Where am I looking? <laughs> All right, so thank you for stopping by. And if you like this video, go ahead and click like. And if you uh, would like to be notified when I upload more videos, I try to do one a week, either piano or organ, please consider clicking subscribe and the bell. And uh, Thank you again, uh, subscribers. I just, uh, heartfelt thanks to you and for all your wonderful comments. I really do appreciate it. All right, we'll catch you later.